Hello guys, welcome back to my channel. So yung topic naman natin ngayon is factoring sum of two cubes and difference of two cubes. So ito yung mga formula niya. So makikita nyo, yung factors ng ating sum of two cubes and difference of two cubes is composed siya ng binomial and trinomial. So yung binomial natin, equal lang siya sa cube root ng first term and second term. Okay? So makikita nyo. And then yung sign niya, is nakabase dito sa sign. Kung positive siya, positive din. Kung minus, minus. And then yung trinomial naman natin, yung first term and last term niya is equal lang sa squared ng first term and last term ng ating binomial. And then yung middle term, uh, product lang siya ng first term and second term ng binomial. So A times B. And then, opposite yung sign nila. Okay? Positive, negative. Dito. Negative, positive. Okay? So, try natin gamitin yung formula dito sa examples. So, for number 1, factor x cubed minus 27. So, first, check muna natin kung difference of 2 cubes ba siya or sum of 2 cubes. So, titignan mo lang yung mga terms. Dapat perfect cube siya. So, pag variable, tignan mo lang yung exponent. Dapat divisible siya by 3. So, ito. 3 siya. So, perfect cube siya. So, yung 27. So, nandun yung mga list na mga numbers na uh, perfect cube. So, para meron kayong guide. So, 27, perfect cube ba siya? Yes, equal siya sa 3 cube. So, difference of 2 cube siya. So, pwede natin gamitin yung formula. So, ano daw yung pag-factor niya? So, compose siya ng binomial and trinomial. Okay? So, yung binomial natin, cube root lang ng first term and last term. So, ano yung cube root ng x cube? That is x. Okay? Pag nag-cube root tayo, divide 3 lang yung exponent. Okay? So 3 divide 3, that is 1. So x to the 1 na lang siya. Or x. And then copy lang yung sign. Then cube root ng second term. So 27 is 3 cube. So yung cube root niya is 3. Okay, so tignan nyo lang doon yung mga list natin. And then yung trinomial natin, nakabasa dito yung value. So, yung first term natin is square lang ng first term ng binomial. So, square ng x, that is x squared. And yung last term natin is square ng second term ng binomial. So, square ng 3, that's 9. Okay? Then, for the middle term, opposite sign, minus plus. You know? Minus plus. And then, multiply lang natin yung first term and second term ng binomial. 3 times x, that is 3x. Okay? So, yun na yung factors ng ating difference of two cubes. For number two. So, factor 8y cubed minus 64. So, check muna natin kung perfect cube ba yung mga terms natin. So, yung 8, perfect cube ba siya? Yes, equal siya sa 2 cube. Then, yung y cube. Yes, kasi yung exponent niya, divisible by 3. 64. Perfect cube ba siya? Yes, equal siya sa 4 to the power of 3. 4 cube. Okay? So now, factor natin siya gamit yung formula. So, compose ng binomial and trinomial yung factors ng difference of 2 cube. And then, una, sa binomial natin, kunin lang natin yung mga cube root nito. So, cube root ng 8, that is 2. Kasi 2 cube is equal to 8. Cube root ng y cube. Divide 3 lang yung exponent, so maybe y. Then, copy the sign. Cube root ng 64. That is 4. Kasi, 4 cube is equal to 64. And then, sa trinomial naman tayo, yung first term and last term ng trinomial, equal lang siya sa squared ng first term and second term ng trinomial. So, squared natin si first term. 2 squared, that is 4. And then, y squared. Okay. Then, for the last term, square natin yung second term. Square ng 4, that is 16. So, plus. Lagi siyang plus dito, no? And then, yung sign dito, opposite lang, minus, plus. And then, multiply natin si first term and second term ng binomial. 4 times, 2y times 4, that is 8y. Okay? So, ganun lang. And for the last example natin, factor... 5H plus 40HKQ. So, check muna natin kung perfect cube ba siya. 
yung mga terms natin. So, 5H, hindi, naman siya, hindi siya perfect cube. Then, 40H, K cube. So, yung 40, hindi siya perfect cube. So, hindi natin pwede gamitin yung formula. Pero, uh, meron tayong pwedeng factor. Okay? So, divisible by 5 silang dalawa, yung mga numbers natin. Then, yung H, may common sila, pwede natin ilabas yung H. So, factor natin yung 5H. So, ano matitira dito? 1 na lang. Uh, 40 divided by 5, that's 8. Then, yung H, tanggal na, A cube na lang matitira. So, now, ito, so, check natin kung sa mag 2 cubes ba siya. So, perfect cube ba yung 1? Yes. Uh, 1 cube is equal to 1. Then, yung 8, perfect cube siya. Equal siya sa 2 cube. And then, yung K cube, so, divisible by 3 yung exponent, so perfect cube. So, ito, sa mag 2 cube siya. So, pwede natin siya ma-factor gamit yung formula. So, so lagay muna natin si 5H. And then, factor natin tong uh, 1 plus 8K cube. So, sum of 2 cube siya. So, compose siya ng binomial and trinomial. So, yung binomial natin, uh, cube root lang ng first term and second term. So, cube root ng 1 is 1. Then, copy lang natin yung sign. Then, cube root ng 8, that is 2. Cube root ng K cube is K. And then, Yung trinomial natin, yung first term and last term, square lang siya ng first term and last term ng binomial. So, square ng 1 is 1. Square ng 2K, that is 4K squared. And then, opposite yung sign dito. So, plus pala ito. Opposite yung sign. So, plus siya, minus siya dito. And then, multiply lang natin. First term and second term ng binomial. 1 times 2K, that is 2. Okay? So, yung factors nito is 5H times 1 plus 2K times 1 minus 2K plus 4K squared. Okay? So, meron din mga ganitong problem. Okay? Kailangan mo munang i-factor para maging sum of 2 cubes siya or difference of 2 cubes. Please comment below na katuloy yung video nito. Thank you for watching and don't forget to like this video.